I mean, a real red-blooded man, I don't care what color you were, can you imagine giving 100 Kim Jong-ils a club and getting in a, getting in a warehouse locked up with them? And, and you had a club, what you could do to 100 Kim Jong-uns. I mean, just the fact that he, it's just, it's just screaming failure, screaming weakness. And then we look at our enemies, MSNBC, Obama, the globalist, all these UN people. They're all the same. They're Kim Jong-un wannabes. They're nobodies. No one wants them. No one loves them. They have no power. They have no energy. They have no soul. They have no renaissance. They have no lightning. They are complete, pathetic maggots, absolutely trying to strangle human beauty, strangle human competition, strangle our mission to colonize space, strangle our mission to ascend into what God has planned for us. These people cannot rule over us, cannot control us, and should not exist. They're in the news. Democratic Party chiefs are in the news saying, we want Alex Jones shut off. And then there's legal threats in one hour on a major funding site when a guy with five TV shows that is the star of three of them, because he's so credible, says, I can't get Discovery or History or anybody else to fund this. I've got the production crews. I've got the military involved in the raids in Europe and the U.S. ready to share with us footage, share with us info. We're just going to put it out. And they're like, uh, within one hour, shutting us down. Can you imagine how scared they are? Because... Craig understands the final piece is media that's willing to tell it and show it. Can you imagine the footage of kids in cages? That's where they were in California, just in this raid. We know people on the raids. You imagine them pulling two-year-old skeletons out of acid that aren't totally dissolved yet? It's game over, folks. We are inches away from game over right now. I, I'm not going to even tell you anymore, folks, but we're talking kids strapped in, tops of their heads cut off, devil worshippers in their brain. Now let's go ahead and take the phone calls. 